We're at Disney's Animal Kingdom today. We've got Alyssa with me. We were stuck in traffic for a little bit. Oh, we should have waited. But we are here. I know, the tram is right here. That's all right. We're, we decided to walk instead of take the tram. Probably a good idea since Alyssa has a skirt on and she's freezing cold. So walking will warm her up. Anyhow, we're here at Animal Kingdom for the day. Well, and, for, well the day. For, for a good portion of the day. And we're gonna see what we can do here today. I wanna try some food and go on some, go on some rides. We got lightning lanes for the safari, Kilimanjaro, Kilimanjaro safari, first thing. Yeah, we have, to, so. we have 22 minutes to get there. All right, let's go. Animal Kingdom, we just got through security. Now we just gotta get through the line and head to our lightning lane. Yes, we have to use the restrooms. I don't know, it's hard to tell how it's gonna be today, if it's gonna be busy or not. I know, I can't tell, it's not super busy right now. Yeah. Like coming in was quick, but yeah. it might be busier inside. Yep. Everyone's probably at Pandora. Probably. All right, we made it through. The pass holder line was exceptionally long, and the man working there was exceptionally cranky. <laughs> Cranking at everybody. Not a very nice Disney employee happy to see everybody. There's the tree, and we are hustling to get our lightning lane to the safari. <laughs> All right, to the left, I think. We've got to kind of, we've got to go towards Africa. Yeah. It looks busy here today. I don't know if it's just because we're like in the hub right now. Yeah. We're gonna have to take a breather after this, huh? <laughs> gonna have to dab in some breakfast. Yes, I'm. Sorry. Me too. I do have chocolate chip cookies in my bag if we need something. All right, we sprinted to Kilimanjaro Safari to make our lightning lane. I think we've got what, like three minutes to spare? Four minutes. <sighs> We're definitely gonna need a coffee and food after this. <laughs> Because I am they have, starving. Uh, breakfast sandwiches over there. Ooh. Oh, lightning lane is that way? Is it? Yeah. Lightning lane. Okay, let me get my thing out. <laughs> we can do. <laughs> okay. We don't really need a lightning for that. What about, um. Yeah, I was gonna say like Navi River. Next what? Time, can't get it oh, really? Yeah. We'll take it and maybe you can keep refreshing and see if you can find something else. Right. It's only a few five minutes. Yeah, dinosaurs usually pretty quick. So we're in the lightning lane line. And straight down. Thanks. Thanks. Enjoy Thank you. Yeah, it's definitely busy here today. Today, by learning about the amazing animals that live here, you can learn to respect some of the animals here and also some of those those in your neck of the woods as well. Up to our right hand side now, this is an okapi. The okapi, believe it or not, is the only living relative of the giraffe. You can see the male has some nesting material in his beak there, carrying a really large ship there. <laughs> Those birds stand about five feet tall with a wingspan as wide as the canopy above our heads. Coming up on our left now, guys, a black rhinoceros. Super lucky to see them out in the open here. They can be pretty secretive. These are females. You can tell that they are girls since they're missing the corkscrewing spiraled horns that the males of their species usually have. She is posing. 
on our right, we're also super lucky to see hippopotamus out of the water. There's even more of them over to our left here in the water as well. You'll notice they're all fast asleep. I think I see one poking their eye out. Starting to enter the savanna down here in the valley. One of the most iconic plants that grows on the savanna is this massive tree to our right. This is the baobab tree, sometimes called the upside down tree or tree of life. That great wildebeest migration is considered to be one of the seven wonders of the natural world because it is one of the largest movements of any animal on the planet. Up here on our right, folks, the two that are approaching us, some of my favorites here on the savanna. It is a male and female pair of common eland, the second largest species of antelope in the world. Oh, and these wildebeest look like they might be crossing the road in front of us. Oh, and so is this giraffe. <laughs> Let's see, who gets the right of way? Okay, there they go. Wildebeest are thinking about crossing the road. Nope, they're just going down the side. Okay. New Zealand, by the way, even at their massive size, are still capable of jumping eight feet into the air when they're trying to escape predators. You can see the male is the one who's further down there, a bit beefier than his female counterpart who's higher up. Oh, this will be going real close to the road. There we go. Great view of all these animals, guys. This will be so super close to us here. You might be able to see a glimpse of that giraffe's tongue, by the way. Their tongue is 18 inches long. Between the trees on our right, everybody, I see that looks like a massive African bull, actually. Males like him, of course, are the largest animals that walk the planet today. Oh, there's the hind end of that bull elephant, folks. They look like they were. Oh, this one's getting a good scratch on this log here to our right. <laughs> Although that skin is super thick, as you can see, still needs maintenance. Largest rhinos in the world, getting up to 5,000 pounds. Also by far the most social rhinos. These cats, of course, are the fastest land animals on the planet, able to reach speeds of 65 There's two of them. miles an hour. Three of them. In just a few seconds. There are more than a few of them out here, actually. Let's see three of them straight out now. So it was a little bit of a wait, but worth it. The coffee, there's the coconut coffee, is really good. I needed some. Workers and then right here the under. tachas. Right here. These are like tater tots with cheese and mm. bacon and... I don't know what those big things are. I think it's um cheese curd. Oh, nice. Yeah. It's so yummy. Mm. So good. Look at that. Mm. Delicious. Delicious. Let's eat. So the breakfast was delicious. Delicious. The tachas, the breakfast tachos were so yum. so good. I love like I nachos. Know. I love nachos anyhow. The cheese curds too. I made it delicious. Yeah, so good. Highly recommend. The line was a little long. I mean, what did we wait? Maybe 15, 15 minutes? minutes? But it was also because I think someone was having a card reader issue. So we were stuck there for a second, but... Yeah, but definitely stop there and get breakfast. And, and coffee. And, and the, yeah, the coconut, coconut coffee, coffee is, is really so good. good. So yeah, 10 out of 10 food there. And we shared one. Oh yeah. We shared, which is good. And we're sharing a coffee too. So that way we can try lots of different stuff today. And not get overly full. Not be gluttons. Right. So yeah, we're on our way to Dinosaur. I don't think the line is very long. It said five minutes on the app. We got a lightning lane for Navi River, but it's not until like noontime. So we're gonna just try to do some line rides. Maybe do Tough to be a bug. Tough to be a bug. Um you know, maybe see a show or something. But yes, we're full. So we're here at Dinosaur. There was a five minute late wait online, but now it says 25 minutes, which still is not too bad. I'll do 25 minutes. I won't do much longer than that though. But Dinosaur is a bouncy <laughs> ride. <laughs> Exploration to the past. Yes. So we made it into the big dinosaur room. 
Why? 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 Pluto, Alyssa, well, we both saw him, but he's been her favorite since she's been very little. Pluto and Stitch. And now we are heading to Bug's Life. It's tough to be a bug. I figured that's usually not super long of a line. And then we were able to get our lightning lane I, Navi. For Navi River for okay, a little bit River. sooner. What was it, 11, 11 something? 20. 11 20? Rather than. 120? Yeah. 130, whatever. Yeah, we just kept refreshing, modifying the Lightning Lane reservation and refreshing it. And finally, a, an earlier one popped up. So, we're gonna go to Bugs Life. And then we are gonna go to. over to Pandora and maybe like grab another stack or something. Alyssa wants one of those pineapple or wonton like things. Yeah, so I forget what they're called, oh, but either. they're really good. They're like a fried, okay. it's a cream cheese or like a uh, ricotta or something with pineapple. With pineapple, pineapple like fried. fried in like a wonton wrapper. It's right here, mom. Oh, okay, 10 minutes. I love this line going into Bugs Life that wraps around the tree and you get to see all the different like carvings of the different animals in the tree. This is like one of my favorite lines or favorite cues in rides. Yep, it definitely does. So we got our bug glasses. Oh, oh, but they want us to go all the way down. We're expecting a full show. Keep on heading all the way down. We're going all the way down. So Tough to be a bug was so cute. I love that show. And I think they like revamped a lot of the effects a little bit because I noticed like everything seemed a little bit more dramatic. The spray can was like really spraying super stuff. It was so smoky. I mean, you couldn't smell it, but it was just like you couldn't see anything. Yeah, you couldn't see anything. It was really cool actually. Uh, All right, to we need to go to Pandora. I love Pandora. It's so pretty here. It's even pretty at nighttime. So our lightning lane is just about ready, about five minutes for Navi River. But I just wanted to come 
see the pretty scenery. It's so pretty. So we are going on Navi River. We have a lightning lane for it. And neither of us have done... Oh, it's open again? What? Finding Nemo? They're doing yes, that. I think so. Um, it's been forever since I've done this. It's The line is always super long for Navi. And it's a boat ride. So it's definitely worth the lightning lane because I wouldn't wait longer than like 20 minutes for it. So lightning lane is awesome for this type of a ride. We literally didn't wait at all. I'm excited to do this one. Oh, nice. We're on our own little boat. That's what they're called. We were trying to remember the name. Thank you. Okay, so we ended up with a Pongo Lumpia. I think that's what you're, how you pronounce it. Yeah, these have been like my fave for a while. And a water. Is it still good? Is it coming? Mm -hmm. <laughs> still good? Mm -hmm. All right, we got our little snack and some water. And now we're gonna just kind of relax, walk yeah. around, maybe go check out some animals. Probably um, take the train to... Yeah, we can take the train over to affection section or conservation station, yeah. whatever it's called. And uh, I wanna do the drawing class, I love that. Yeah, that's fun. Last so we could do that. Got... What did we get last time? Character member. member Jason. We did do it. Uh -huh. I don't remember who we got. I don't remember either. I feel like it was Olaf, but I don't think it was. It might have been. It might have been. All right, let's head towards Africa, and we can go see the gorillas. We can walk the uh -huh. gorilla trek. See the tigers. And yeah, go see the tigers. Yeah, let's see. The tigers are in Asia, though. Mm. So. We're gonna just kind of walk around. So we are going on Gorilla Falls Exploration Trail. And this is just a nice little walking trail where you can see the gorillas. Is it just the gorillas? I think, I don't know, there's a different one for tigers. And then there's, I don't know if there's anything, there's a bird one. So what's over here? The yellow-backed diker. Is he up there? Oh, there he is. We saw this on the, um... yeah, remember? We saw one. Yeah, it was like the first thing we saw. I don't know what being called that. Oh, 
it's a bunny. We're seeing wildlife in the wild. <laughs> We're going into the research center. I think this is where the snakes and spiders and stuff are, or the reptiles. What's in here? It's busy here today. Can you see anything over here? Oh, let's walk. Can't see anything. Anything in there? Oh yeah, there's the snake. Yep. Picking his button. <laughs> All right, so we are now over at the Maharaja Jungle Trek to see the tigers in Asia. Oh, there's a dragon over there. Is it a Komodo dragon? Oh yeah, there he is. This is Kipling. <laughs> there he is. Survivor. Oh, yeah. China. Yeah. We're getting our steps in today, that's for sure. Doing all these treks. Tigers are frequently encountered in the ruins ahead. What? The, are there some sort of a monkey up there? Yeah, the train. Yep. I'm gonna get it done soon. My stomach's Are you getting food. hungry? Yeah, I can feel it. Well, after this, we'll just go to the place and get a drink and an app. Do they have food there? Yeah, I think oh, so. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Okay. This is where the bats are. Those huge, big vampire bats. Look at them. This way. Can we see any? Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I can't see them over there. They're sleeping, and I don't see them. Don't see any. I always loved this area. The tiger ruins. Any tigers in here? Is he up there? Oh yeah, there he is. Let's see if we can see him. He's up there. He's laying down. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if we can see him a little better. He's a fat boy. <laughs> Expedition. Remember the um, kite show here? Yeah. No, I yeah. We stayed for that one. Yeah, we did. I think that was like one of the last times you and I came together. So we are in the Restaurantosaurus Lounge. And we are going to get a cocktail. Bye, Abby. Bye. 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 B
Right. Yeah, we're fine with him right now. We're not in. Maybe the tequila sora. Sure. See? Yeah. Or, sure. or the mojito yeah. one. That one looks good too. Bourbon sour. Lime juice, sweet and sour. Yeah, let's get that one. So tomorrow. Elissa and I are going to be doing sips and sweets at Epcot. So we're going to be doing all items that are sweet and alcoholic beverages. Today, we're just going to try a beverage here from the restaurant, the Taurus Lounge. It's kind of hidden right near Dinosaur. And usually they have some pretty good cocktails here. So we got a mojito style one. Alyssa's up there getting it right now. Found a cute little spot right here in the corner to kind of chill out. And we've done pretty much everything that we want to do here today and it's only one o'clock. So we're gonna have our drink, kind of relax, maybe shop around, and then head to check into our hotel or our villa, because we're gonna be staying at a villa. How cute! Look at that! That's so cute! There's our little mojito style drink. We got the fossil. What was it? A fermented fossil. Time to drink. It's a real bird. It's a bird. It's a real bird. <laughs> Look at him. Well trained bird. He's very well trained. Don't worry, Alyssa has been having a cocktail, so she thinks this is a real bird. <laughs> no, he where? No. Kevin? No, Kevin. Kevin. Yes, it's Kevin. It's Kevin. Yes, there's Kevin. 